Ram's first all-electric model, the 1500 Revolution pickup, is so bold you might forget it won't hit the market until 2024, well after most of the competition. The truck is just a concept for now, but the real deal will break cover in a few months with much of the styling and features set intact. It lays the rails to Ram's future with a mission to redefine the pickup segment, CEO Mike Koval Jr. said. Everything you see from now on will be a direct descendant of this. Ram has indeed had a good long look at what other electric trucks have to offer, and Koval spent the past year saying the brand will use its come-from-behind status to top the field in the key areas that matter to buyers, towing and payload, range, and charge time. The towing and payload numbers remain unknown, but the body on frame STLA frame platform under the truck was designed to provide up to 500 miles from a single charge, eventually, some of the technology isn't ready yet. For now, the automaker is saying only that the REV will offer class leading range, which means it should still top 400 miles, the max figure promised by Chevy's Silverado EV. It also touts the ability to add up to 100 miles worth of juice in about 10 minutes with 800 volt DC fast charging at up to 350 kilowatts. Like the competition, the RAM will offer the capability to plan and schedule charging at off-peak times, when electricity is cheaper. And the truck can be used to power tools, a home, or other vehicles. Ram also showed a new inductive robot charger called the Ram Charger, a classic name we wish the company used for the truck itself that detects whether the vehicle is present as well as its state of charge, and then it aligns itself underneath to deliver electricity. The designers wanted a look dramatically different from the brand's ice trucks and thus went for an appearance both brutal and beautiful or as head of design Ralph Gillis calls it, brutal. Ram influence is present in the fender flares and accentuated coke bottle shape, while the truck's face has animated lights, new Ram badging, and an LED tuning fork headlight design. The cab forward design is applied to a truck 4.0 inches longer than today's 1500s, while bed length remains the same. The roof height is lower for better aerodynamics, and the final product will come only as a Ford door crew cab, the preferred configuration of 80 to 90% of buyers, Koval said. The doors are much more than simple portals, featuring removable speakers, portable battery chargers, and storage compartments that can be heated or cooled as well as hold tow straps or house a first aid kit. The rear hinged units will give way to conventionally opening doors with B-pillars when the rev hits dealers, we were told. The cabin has a removable slash slidable center console, and like GM's electric trucks, the Revolution has a powered midgate that folds into the cabin and features a window that can be lowered. But the Ram goes a step further, move the first two rows of seats forward via the Ram track floor mount system to reveal a third row of seats, a surprise in a pickup. You can take the lower portion of these jump seats and use them outside the truck, as well as remove the front seats and remount them in the tracks backward. Also cool, the 18-foot-long pass-through that runs from the front all the way to the tailgate, to fit objects such as PVC piping and wood planks. Yes, there is a front, a front trunk where an engine would normally be. We don't have dimensions yet, but it falls between the huge compartment in the F-150 Lightning and the shallower and narrower spaces of the Silverado and GMC Sierra EVs. The Revolution's front also has Ram track rails, as well as dividers, cup holders, a drain, and four power outlets. The front lid is powered and opens and closes via touch. The tailgate is also powered, as are the side and rear steps. Inside the high-quality, futuristic cabin, the steering wheel has a flat top and collapsible bottom with enhanced hand grips, capacitive controls, digital screens, and an illuminated RAM badge. In this concept's theoretical level 3 plus autonomous mode, the steering wheel motors to a horizontal position and then slides into the dash. The lower interior screen tilts through three positions and can also be removed like a tablet. The driver has an augmented reality head-up display, there is no instrument cluster, while the windshield and roof are one piece of glass that spans the cab. You can swipe to adjust how much light comes in through each quadrant of the roof, similarly, with no sun visors, front occupants can touch and slide on the windshield to set a tint level. You can ask the truck to follow me with shadow mode, whereby it will automatically tag along behind a person for those times when you need to move a short distance and don't want to hop back behind the wheel. The truck follows at a safe distance, using sensors and camera technology to navigate around obstacles like a huge, robotic puppy.
My day does your trip planning, smart home control turns on the heat and lights in your home while you're still en route, and cabin mode sets the mood to be productive, social, relaxed, or party. There is an exterior projector for movie night. Oh, and an app helps measure objects to see if they'll fit in the truck, saving you from soul-crushing despair. The SCLA frame architecture was designed for heavy vehicles, and it can accommodate plenty of power for future variants, think 1500 TRX, but electric. All-wheel drive is achieved via two electric motors, one in front and one in back, and the Revolution has rear-wheeled steering with up to 15 degrees of articulation. The entire RAM lineup will eventually be electrified, look for a truckload of news throughout the year, Koval said. That includes a future Ram 1500 with a small gas engine to extend the range. For now, we're told Ram is monitoring reactions to the 1500 EV concept and actively developing some of the truck's more innovative features, including the third row seating, flexible cabin layout, and super long pass-through. Ram may be late to the EV truck fight, but it's coming well armed. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more awesome content. Leave a comment below and let us know what you thought of the video. Until next time, see you in the next one.